it's week two of the Fat Kid Diet. Um, we went to uh, the BHA rendezvous in, in Montana, so that did kind of mess me up a little bit. But hey, I'm proud to announce I'm down to 226, so I'm down two pounds. 226, so that's exciting. Um, I hiked every day. The only problem that I see is I need to take better count of my calories going in because I just seem to eat crap all the time still. And I've tried to uh, regulate what I'm eating and the actual, you know, eat whole foods instead of crap. But I still think I'm overeating on the calories. So I'm going to address that this week. I am going to Texas, so it should be interesting to see if I can keep the weight loss going. This is going to be a really <clears throat> diet-based week to where i got to watch my diet because I'm not going to be able to get, I don't think, the physical activity that I need to continue to lose weight. So the diet's going to be key this week. I did get a question that I want to address. Um, <clears throat> the guy asked, how could I hunt 80 days last year and still be fat? Well, I think for some reason in this day and age, people think that you have to be a world-class athlete to hunt uh, the, the western United States. Well, I shot six animals last year and I was in average shape at best. So for those guys that want to come out and hunt, hopefully in my, my whole life I pushed myself, my whole life I've hunted in the West, so I kind of knew what I'm going against and mentally I want to do something, I'm going to get there. But don't let your, your you know, you don't have to be a top peak athlete to come out West and be successful. Because like if you look into our podcast with Robbie, I, I shoot multiple animals every year and haven't been in real good shape in the last 10, but you mentally got to check in because you are going to have to push yourself. There's a particular spot where I hunt deer. It's 3,000 vertical feet in one mile. And I noticed over the last couple years that I would go there four or five times a year. Well, last year I went there twice because I didn't physically want to climb that hill. So that's part of the reason that I want to get in better shape this year so I can you know, get to where I want to be quick and as fast and effortless as possible and obviously you want to lose weight to stay in shape to live longer that's a no-brainer so anyways i'll uh, check back in next week thanks for uh, watching oh yeah you can get 20 percent off mountain ops products by using the code fat kid and i'd appreciate it fat kid at mountain thanks